Hey guys, welcome to Convolution. My name's Khan, and today I was so surprised when I woke up and found out the Game of Thrones Season 8 official trailer had dropped, bro! Oh my god, I'm so excited for this final season and a little bit sad too now that it's coming to an end. But oh my god, I, that goes without saying that I'm a huge Game of Thrones fan. I've been watching Game of Thrones back since Season 1 first dropped. So my watch started a very, very long time ago, and I've been waiting for the long night for the, you know, for the longest time, as, you know, many of you other fans have as well. So, uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna react to the the trailer and then I watch it again and then I'll uh, have a little breakdown afterwards so stay tuned after the reaction all right so uh, without further ado let's just go ahead and dive in bro yes oh, oh, oh shit Arya oh damn she's bleeding what the hell I know death Davos dude what is she running away He's got many faces. They're hiding underneath the crypts of Winterfell? They made it inside! The White Walkers made it inside! I to seeing this one. <laughs> oh shit! April 14th, we're the month away! Oh, the Iron Fleet! Oh, that's gotta be the Golden Company, right? They made it back! Where you belong. The Red Keep? Oh, damn, you see her, like, new outfit? Oh. The army's rushing out. Oh, the Mother of Dragons and Kings! No! Sounds like it's the Sea Dragons for the first time, yes! They're coming. They're coming. Our enemy doesn't tire. Yes, the smith! The warrior! Ah, the maiden! <laughs> oh my god. Jamie! He's fighting alongside them, he made it! Oh man, okay. <laughs> you see the money in every shot, bro. Holy crap! Damn, Grey Little Worm looks badass! I intend to keep that promise. Old Keeper, bro! Morning breakfast? <laughs> oh, shit. Holy crap! Oh, oh Brian and Pod! Jorah, bro! They're here, dude! Holy crap! Winterfell about to become Winter Hell, dude! The hot pie was right! Oh my god, dude, April 14th, we're just a month away! Alright, okay, I'm gonna uh, quickly um, rewatch these, uh, rewatch this trailer and then uh, get back with you with the breakdown. Alright, 3, 2, 1, let's go! Alright guys, let's quickly uh, go through the trailer and I'll give you like what my thoughts are on the uh, what's about to happen, like some theories for the Game of Thrones Season 8, alright? So we kind of open on this... Uh, um, clip of Arya running through the um what I'm guessing is the hallways of Winterfell and it's really crazy because she's all sweaty and worn out and dude I'm scared for this scene because it looks like you know she underwent you know, like a huge like this is like the aftermath of a huge battle because she's all bleeding and stuff and then she's it looks like she's got a um uh the the, the dragon glass uh, weapon which i'm guessing you know of course all those soldiers are going to be carrying from now on since you know they got uh, all of them manufacturing these new um obsidian weapons and it looks like she's running away and then you see davos in the battlement it's giving me like major helms deep feeling just from like the the setting take you know the battle takes place at night time and like you know with the, the the blue and red you know coloring palette Oh man, okay, so she's running away and you see like in the crypts of Winterfell all like the women and children and um, you know, uh, Varys is uh They're hiding underneath so I'm guessing like with the, with the look on Varys' face It looked like you know They must have definitely broken through or something because later on in the trailer You see that you know John's like all worn out and beaten up and they're like holding up against the gate So I don't know what the time frame of this battle is that they're showing in the trailer Which is good because you know, you don't want to reveal everything too quickly uh, Arya is still like running through the 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 whole the hallways April 14th. All right, cool. Ooh, see now you get to get a chance to see the Iron Fleet. Oh, uh, I love this shot, and I love the shots and all the all the scenes and, and this trailer. You really see the money in every shot. I mean, they they uh, condensed the, ser uh, the this last uh, season to only six episodes, but you can definitely see that they put their effort and money into it. Because look at how shiny their armor is, and this is clearly the Golden Company that you know at the end of last season. Uh, Cersei said that Euron Greyjoy and the Iron Fleet were gonna ferry the Golden Company from Essos over to Westeros to fight for Cersei. Okay, so here you see Ed, Barrett Dendarrion, and uh, Tormund. Okay, so they made it back safely, thank god. Yeah, after that freaking, uh, um, the wall collapsed. Uh, Sam and, um, Bran. 
the red key really nice okay so i love like what they're doing with her outfit oh my god like it's all golden and shiny and sparkly i mean everything is just like you know amped up you know for this final season oh man Okay, so here, I, I'm guessing this is like, um, you see Winterfell in the distance, so this is like a small village area next to Winterfell. I, I, I'm not too certain which village it is, but you, um, you get to see like all the warriors moving out and all the villagers preparing for the battle ahead. Oh man. Oh, and then you can see King Jon Snow and the Mother of Dragons. I guess this is like from, this scene is directly from episode one when they're uh, making their way together into Winterfell, introducing themselves to everybody oh and then Sansa gets to see all the dragons oh so I, I can't wait to see like what her actual expression is gonna be I mean obviously th this kind of uh, gives it away a little bit but um, I I'm guessing this isn't the full her full reaction to the dragon so let's I'm very eager to see that oh man oh I guess John introduces her to the crypts uh, it'll be interesting to see if, if they actually find out their relationship, you know, like their, uh, their, their kind of, uh, their blood relationship. I wonder how they're gonna handle that, you know? Oh, and I love this scene, like, you know, uh, Gendry is in charge of, well, not in charge, but is helping, you know, uh, build all the obsidian weapons, and he's the smith, you know, he's the smith. Oh, and we got the warrior Jorah uh, preparing for battle, and I love, you know, here, uh, when John, John's narrating these scenes, and he's, like, saying that they don't feel anything, and then at, at that exact same moment, like, the scene is, the, that dialogue is mimicked by what's happening in the scene is Missandei kissing, you know? Grey Sunday! Well, I guess that's Jorah fighting Jorah or somebody I can't really make it out and then we see uh Jamie get fighting with them thank god oh my god he made it oh uh, okay I really like the expression I love how Lena Headey is playing Cersei's character or has been playing Cersei's character oh my goodness like the, you see like all these expressions on her face in this one little scene oh my Oh, the dragons look better than ever. Oh my god. I don't know where that scene is. It looks like this is giving me like major Lord of the Rings two towers feeling. I don't know. Like everybody's running away. I guess by the look on Arya's face, after being a faceless assassin, Arya isn't surprised by a lot of things. And it appears like she's legitimately surprised. Everybody's running away. I'm guessing like they're seeing one of the horsemen on top of like a, some mountain or something and it's really freaking them out. That, or maybe this is the entrance to the dragons. The dragons are coming and everybody's just freaking out. Oh my God, you know, uh, Aegon's come back. Well, he literally has come back, you know. Aegon, John Targaryen. <laughs> I see what you did there, uh, HBO. All right. Oh, damn, do you see the look on freaking Grey Worm's face, dude? He looks like he's ready for battle. John's next to the Werewood Tree. Oh, man, we got a uh, freaking Clegane Bowl. I guess maybe that's like the prelude to the Cl Clegane Bowl about to happen. John, I mean, Jamie being the Oath Keeper. See, that's the scene I was talking about. <laughs> and uh, I guess uh, Drogon and Rhaegal are having their uh, breakfast. <laughs> uh, Sansa. Oh, the Arya's fighting and kicking ass. I'm yeah, hoping, you know. Uh, I don't know what's happening with the Daenerys and Tyrion and the dragon fire breath. Yes, boy! Oh, and then this last shot is just so ominous and dark and somber and just like the battle ahead. And I love the way it ended. It's just the, you know, the dead horse's feet. Oh, god damn it. Yes! Damn, that's so cool, man. The final season of Game of Thrones is gonna be lit! April 14, I can't believe we're just like a month away, dude. That's crazy. That's crazy. I'm so hyped and excited. I'll have my reaction now because usually every year I react with all my relatives together. So, hopefully, you know, it'll be a really fun time and a wonderful time. And I also watch like other people's reactions of uh, Game of Thrones, the season episodes, you know. Oh, man, I can't wait. So uh, leave your comments down below. What did you guys think of the trailer? Are you guys as excited as I am or even more excited? Uh, you know, leave your comments down below. If you guys are enjoying my videos hit a like subscribe and share and i'll see you guys later at the next reaction video all right so until then uh, have a wonderful day uh look forward to game of thrones season eight and uh, bye thanks again for watching and if you enjoyed this reaction please leave a like comment subscribe and share and i will see you later